All right, 713. Let's go to Burlington County now. A wildfire in Burlington County at the Bass River State Forest. Hi, Hank. And you can see just by looking Hank. what's going on behind you, Hank, we can tell it's hazy. Oh, yeah. That's what I mean, guys. The old saying down the shore is red skies at night, sailors delight, but up here in the pines, it's red sun in the morning. It must mean that there's a fire in Bass River State Park. That's apparently the deal. Forest Service were putting the word out last night that the Timberline Lake Campground had been evacuated. Uh, I've spoken with first responders here this morning, not the chief of the fire service who we're hoping to hear from, uh, but uh, first responders here this morning have told me uh, that no one was hurt from that campground, either campers or, or residents or first responders, firefighters, any of that. Uh, and I'm also hearing uh, that the campers were actually sent home. None of them were from too far away that they couldn't just pack it up, pack the tent up, the camper or whatever it is, and go on home. But what you're seeing there is that truck having a, figuring out exactly where it is that they can go as these U.S. State Park police keep access to that fire area. Uh, limited guys here. We spoke to Bob. He was just trying to get up to the Mercer County area to get a couple of trucks up there to do some work. He may be an hour behind. Here's what he told us. We're trying to get to Hewing, Hewing Township. To Hewing, right near Trenton? Yes. And how's that going to go? Do you know? I'm not. That's what I'm trying to. I sat here on the side of the road with the crew of guys behind me, and I'm trying to find the best way. You might have to go up to 539 and come around. But I don't even know if this road's closed. I'm looking at the uh, maps, mm -hmm. and it looks like this may be closed up here, too. So I'm going to have to turn around and go back to where I came from and get back on the parkway. Now, Bob, you know, uh, so one of a couple of people that we've spoken to are inconvenienced by this fire. Hopefully that's the worst of it. But if you look back there, these workers have just arrived and they're putting up what look not permanent barricades, but uh, certainly ones that keep people from going down that road if that Park Service policeman has to go uh, down the road or answer a call, as he did a short while ago. But again, no one hurt here. We don't know exactly what the status of that fire is down there, if it is under control or not. It certainly seems to be uh, held at bay. That's the best we can do for now, guys. Yeah, a lot of people uh, tweeting about it this morning, too. I, I mean, just look at it.